Let's switch gears now. Talk about the weather. It was gorgeous out today. We were talking earlier. Yes. I was down in Gilroy today. 80s, sunny, mm. not too humid. Could not have been better. Yeah, it doesn't really get better than that this yeah. time of the year. And we're going to be in for more of that here as we head into your weekend forecast. So let's go ahead and take it into that microclimate weather. And we're going to get you all good to go on your Friday night. If you've got big plans, well, I've got to look around the bay and those temperatures you can see in San Francisco right now. We got a small little finger, so to speak, here of fog that's moving uh, in through downtown right now. It is cool. We have 63 degrees winds out of the west northwest at 23. So a little bit gusty and eventually we do get down to some 50s here at 10 p.m. So definitely bring your jacket if you're going into San Francisco. Now across the East Bay, those inland valleys are hot. Maybe it's downtown Walnut Creek. You're at 89 degrees right now. West South West Southwest wind at 11. Eventually we get to some 70s here at 8 and 9 o'clock and then we're going to be down into some 60s uh, once we hit 10 and also 11. I think right now the best spot no doubt to be is San Jose. If you're down here in the South Bay, those temperatures are are comfortable. Pretty much perfect. 76 degrees right now and you'll hold with the 70s next few hours and then we also have some 60s coming your way later on this evening. Now as we head into your Saturday and Sunday forecast, yes, we do have hotter temperatures on the way, but I definitely think we're going to be able to handle this. The change that I'm tracking right now is an area of high pressure that's beginning to move in and just basically get stronger and push closer towards the Bay Area. So that's going to bring up that heat from the south. The other thing it's going to do is uh, continue to keep some fog here at the coastline. So we've got that classic San Francisco summer weather coming our way as we head into this upcoming weekend with some wide varying temperatures. The fog tomorrow morning, it's not going to be super extensive, but I do see it at the coastline near the bay and some patchy low clouds early on at 7 o'clock uh, throughout the East Bay and the South Bay. It'll clear out quickly here uh, by 1030 in the morning. Most of us under sunshine. And then once we hit the afternoon, we do get those sunny skies back for us. So temperatures all in all to begin tomorrow, we started off cool with 58 here through the peninsula South Bay at 59 and we have those 50s over the East Bay San Francisco and the North Bay. Let's get you ready to go for those daytime highs tomorrow and yes it is hotter but San Jose uh, still doing all right at 85 degrees but you get down to Morgan Hill it's going to be a hot 94 over to the East Bay close to 100 98 in Antioch 96 in Concord head over those East Bay Hills a breeze off the water we'll have you at 75 in Oakland looking nice here San Mateo to Palo Alto 70s to low 80s. Let's bring it up to San Francisco. 69 in the Mission and through the North Bay. Maybe just maybe it's wine country. 93 here in Sonoma. As you're out and about, I wanted to show you the allergy forecast tomorrow. Uh, not that bad. Moderate here for privet and chenopods. Otherwise, everything else is low, so we'll be able to manage on that seven day forecast in San Francisco. We hold with steady 60s on that seven day forecast and for inland valleys. While we're hot tomorrow, we turn down that heat as we head into next week. We'll see a system linger just offshore all week long. That's going to keep us in the 80s with more of that fog in the morning and sun for the afternoon. It really is kind of the best recipe. We get hot for a day or two and then we see those numbers slide down. Yeah, I, I mean, so far this summer we haven't experienced that like stretch of hundreds yet. I mean, still a lot of time to go, but which is excellent with that drought in place. Exactly. I mean, yeah, I'm happy about that. Thanks, yeah. Jeff. Got it.